Beetlejuice. 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 What is up everyone? My name is Sin and today we are playing Midnight Cinema, a point and click horror Halloween type game. From what I've seen of it, it, it looks really cool, the art and the game design is really nice. I have not looked into the story of it that much, but let's get right into it and check it out. Greetings, friends. Come in. Don't be shy. My name is Corpsey, and I'm the owner of this theater complex you've just entered. That's kind of a freaky theater complex where the ticket guy is a rotting corpse, kind of messed up, if I do say so myself. But you can tell already that his design is pretty cool, even if. His mouth is going non-stop like a wood chipper. I have a great scary movie for you to enjoy tonight. It tells the story of Grimsboro, a town where a series of murders took place exactly one year ago today. So lie back in your caskets, turn off your cell phones, and turn up your speakers. Enjoy the movie. <laughs> Man, let's get it straight. Nobody turns off their cell phone when going to the movie theater. Like, we've all been there. We're watching a movie, and then, like, one row behind us, right at the back of our heads, it's like... <laughs> ringing, 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 fucking bitch. Slash. Man, it's Halloween, and they're having a special screening of Slash on the Rialto. But it's only for those who have an invitation. I have an invitation if you want. I'm not planning on going. Why not? Are you serious? Today is the one-year anniversary of the Grimsboro murders. The killer will strike again. It's kind of like a Michael Myers Halloween type thing from the looks of it. One year later, murders happen again, freaky shit, you know, pretty normal, common, it's not bad. The killer is dead. He was shot by that Swedish girl, Lisa Westberg. Doesn't really sound like a Swedish name, but hey, I'm not one to judge. Swedish chicks are the bomb, man, the bomb. Yes, but maybe someone will decide to continue the killer's job, or avenge his death. Anyway, I'm not going. In fact, I'm not leaving this apartment tonight, no matter what. Well, that's the story of my life. You ain't getting me out, motherfucker. I'm inside for life. Great. So, bring me the invitation. Not so fast. Since I can't leave my apartment, I want you to do me a favor. Bring me a slice of pizza with olives and mushrooms, and I also want a coffee. Now that is a lot of shit you want for one fucking ticket that you weren't going to use anyways. But okay, bro, I got you covered. Also, I want you to take this copy of the Grimsboro Murders book and get Lisa Westberg to sign it. She's signing her books at the Pika Book Shop. You greedy motherfucker, you want more now. Okay, how hard can that be? Don't agree with him, dude. What the fuck? Alright, so are we into it? Alright, let's see. What do we got here? Randy has a very impressive VHS horror movie collection, including Ghouls Just Wanna Have Fun, Daddy's Little Pumpkin, and Time for a Coffin Break. Uh, Time for a Coffin Break. Sounds like an idea after this video. May I borrow your scissors? Yes, fine, whatever. Yaman, yeah, whatever, Thanks. who cares, dude, like, whatever, take it, who cares? I must borrow your screwdriver. I'll need it to get all the stuff you want. It doesn't make any sense, but whatever. Man, I can so relate to this dude. Just cold, hard, who gives a shit, do whatever the fuck you want. Thanks. Say, Randy, may I borrow your crowbar? 
Yeah, yeah, just take it. Take it, dude. You my brother. Who cares? Thanks. Randy got this giant popcorn mascot from the old movie theater he used to work at. They went out of business, so Randy took it as a souvenir. That is pretty cool. I mean, you don't see giant popcorn mascots like this nowadays, do you? All right, is there anything else in this room to check out? We checked out the popcorn, dude. This guy is a VHS. Nothing. All right, next room. Let's see. It's one of Randy's Halloween props. He decorates the hallway every year. This Grim Reaper reminds me of a joke. Why does the Grim Reaper call the front desk on vacation? For tomb service. <laughs> oh, brother. Five stars. 10-10 IGN. Best joke ever. So, his room is a pretty cool bachelor pad type shit. I don't know. I'm no bachelor. We got a mug. We got a crowbar, screwdriver, scissors. What else is there? Something here. A white bed sheet. Nice. So, bed sheet, scissors. Can I do this? We got a costume. Can I put it on? Put it on, put it on, dude. Wipe off that jizz on your face. Nothing, nothing. All right. I don't have time to read books now. I have a movie to catch. That is a smart idea. Anything here? We got a ducky. Hand towels. All right. My TV remote. I have no idea how it got here. Well, if you don't, neither do I. There's nothing in there. Trust me on that. I don't trust you for shit, dude. Do not trust you at all. There's probably like a dead body or porn or some shit. Maybe a five year old you kidnapped in a white man. Fucking pedo bear looking motherfucker. I don't know, dude. I don't know. Well, nothing else in this room from the looks of it. Let's see if this Bloody Mary story is true. Bloody Mary. Beetlejuice! 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 Ah! <coughs> Did you summon me? I will claw your eyes out and murder you. <coughs> Sorry, Beetlejuice. I won't call you again, dude. <laughs> All right. What else is there to do in this shit? Uh, we got a computer here. I really here. don't have time to play games. Oh well, why not? It's a short one. We always got time to play games. That's the beauty of life. There is never a bad time to play games. You are standing in the cavern of the evil wizard. All around you are the carcasses of slain ice dwarfs. So, we type a command here, and some shit happens. Spoiler alert, I already looked up the answer because it's obscure as fuck. Maybe it's a movie reference, or a game reference, or some shit that I just do not know. If you know, type it down in the comments below. So first, we melt the wizard. What do you want to melt him with? Throw thermal pod, which I don't know what the fuck it's from, if it's a specific reference, but yeah. Booyah! Zap that motherfucker. You have defeated the evil wizard. Soon the entire kingdom will wake up from its winter sleep. With the evil wizards out of the way, you are the new king of this magical place. Fucking awesome king in pink that uh, crown is mwah, a plus a plus dude all right let's get out of here so remote tv no use the tv is broken maybe i should get the batteries out of the remote i just need something to help me open the battery compartment door like a 
screwdriver. Oh, wait, I meant the crowbar, but screwdriver is probably better. All right, we got a battery. It doesn't work. No. I don't know why the hell I tried that, but okay. Anything else here? Captain I'll Crunch? I'll peanut butter crunch later. I have a movie to catch. Okay, you don't want cereal? That's messed up, dude. Cereal is good always. Breakfast, lunch, dinner, dessert, brunch, midnight snack, 1 a.m. snack, 2 a.m. snack, like whenever. Okay. So, can we go up here? We got... Let's see if this... Alright, we already did that. That's not important. Storage room. This is where the building's tenants store stuff. I was here a couple of days ago, and not much has changed. There's no light. <clears throat> so, do we need a flashlight or a light bulb or something like that to enter this room? Can we use the battery on something? Anything? No? Anything? Anything? There's something there, but I can't see. Looks like uh, demons from hell waiting to claw out your asshole. Anything? 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 Nope. Well, the battery is useless here. Let's move on. Uh, up here? No, I was already up here. So... Uh, That's my mailbox. I lost its key a few days ago. Is this a key? That's the key to my apartment, but I never locked the door. Well, you're gonna get robbed one day, dude. Like a gigantic guy will come in and butt fuck the shit out of you and steal everything. Alright, so let's go outside, I guess. Trick yeah. or treat, man. No, oh, brother, is this like some stereotypical Toy Story bully? Billy? Aren't you a bit old for trick or treating? You're not even wearing a costume. Fuck you, Billy. Where the hell is Jack Septicai to tell you some shit? You better bring me candy. That is, if you want to see the sunshine again. Fine, I'll get you candy, you punk. Ooh, I'm a tough guy. I'll get you your candy, you punk. You snot-nosed little brat. You whiny motherfucker. Anything else here? Mm. No need to be alarmed. It's just Oscar. He lives in the trash can. You son of a bitch that fucking scared the shit out of me. Don't fucking pop out like that. Oh my god. Oh, <sighs> oh god, like, I'm not even exaggerating, that fucking creeped the shit out of me. Oh, yeah, yeah. Can't do it again, thank fuck for that. Oh yeah, look at this map, skull map, oh yeah. So we got the Caffeine Hub, the Rialto, My Place, Halloween Central, Captain Sauce, and pick a book? Pick a book. So let's check this place out first, maybe? Or Halloween Central? Oh, decisions, decisions. Let's go for the pizza. So we got the Pick a book book signing today with Lisa Westberg. We've got the Captain Sauce. What the fuck is going on with this dude's eyes? You spin me right round, baby, right round. You spin me right round, baby, right round. Oh yeah. They see me rolling, they hating. Oh brother, I don't know lyrics, you motherfucker. Oh man, so this place is orange as fuck. These are all anchovy pizzas. Randy asked for a slice with olives and mushrooms. Oh man, personally, I don't like anchovy pizza. Leave a comment below if you like anchovy. Thanks. Uh, someone left these tongs here. Yeah, that was me. 
They fell on the floor, so I planned to throw them in the trash. I must have forgotten them there while cleaning the table. Uh, may I have them? Knock yourself out. Okay, well, we got some tongs. Thanks. Not sure what they'll be good for yet, but we'll see. Hello, I want a slice of pizza with olives and mushrooms on top. Sorry, man, I'm all out of olives and mushrooms and cheese and tomato sauce. Well, what the fuck do you have? Do you have, like, flour? Do you have garlic? Do you have chocolate? Do you have cola? Do you have some shit? <sighs> but I must have a slice of pizza right now. Uh, sounds like someone's ex-wife. When she's pregnant, knocked up, got the cravings. Give me pizza now! I'll tell you what, you go out there and bring me all the ingredients and I'll do the rest. I'll even give you a discount. That's generous of you. Yeah, you're such a sweetheart, dude. I need to insert a quarter if I want to use this phone. Hmm, this might come in handy later. Not sure where I'll find a quarter, but it might come in handy. Anything else here doesn't look like it. Man, so many options, so little time. Let's go into pick a book. Where's Lisa Westberg? Oh, come on, where the hell did this little Swedish babe go? Lisa, where are you? Lisa! She took her dog Kai for a walk. She'll be back soon, but I'm first in line. I want her to sign all these books and listen to a song I wrote. No. I just wanted her to sign one book. Can I get ahead of you in line? I'm in a real hurry. Nerd. Okay, bring me something sweet to eat, and you'll be in the head of the line. Nerd. So this dude wants candy, the bully wants candy, my frickin' roommate wants everything. Well... I guess the Halloween Central will have candy for all these assholes. So let's check this place out. I think that's a logical next place to check out. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, say no to Halloween. Don't tell me they added a social justice warrior bitch into the Halloween party plans. That is not cool. I don't know if I even want to click on her text to see what she's going to say. Say no to Halloween? Yes. Say no to Halloween. It's the worst holiday ever. Instead of spreading love and joy, people scare each other. Scary props are sold all over the country, and I'm scared of scary props. Oh, you princess, you poor, poor, poor. Poor bastard. Who gives a shit what you're scared of? Who gives a shit about spreading love and joy and scaring each other? It's just the holiday to commemorate the dead. That's why my life's goal is to make the Halloween Central go out of business. Oh yeah, it's your life goal. You're not worth anything else unless you're making other people miserable, taking the fun out of their life. Good luck, kid. Good luck! Hand over your money! I have a goal to achieve and you're paying for it! <laughs> oh god. That is rich. That is something else. Go screw yourself, Betty. Dream on. This one says, I am a ghost. <laughs> LOL. Bad puns are all over this shit. The Slash movie merchandise is everywhere. So Slash is basically a Scream parody. I guess no Michael Myers, but same shit. Horror movies, whatever, who cares. Why? Why am I here? Why Ben Franklin? Thomas Jefferson, who the fuck, I don't care. I can't buy it. Where would I place such a thing? What did the vampire order at the bar? A Bloody Mary. I wouldn't mind eating out a Bloody Mary. 
Got it. I didn't even know if that would work, but... It's blood. There's an... You just need something to... Well, already done with that shit. Hello. Hello, dude! Elvis Presley, what the hell is up, man? Welcome to Halloween Central, your one-stop shop for your Halloween needs. Except for candy and costumes, they're both sold out. Well, that seems to be the common pattern today. Everything is sold out. That's why you don't shop on Halloween day. Or Halloween night, in this case, which is even worse. Like, what the fuck are you thinking, dude? Okay, is there anything to get in this place? No need for that. I'm not going trick-or-treating. I don't care where you're going. I just want shit. Anything else? Nothing? Fine. There's glue in here. Okay, so we got glue. That is cool. Interesting. This table goes right above this annoying girl's head. I bet I can use it to my advantage somehow. Are you gonna choke the life out of her? <laughs> so do we want to go back to the pizza place and check out? Or go to the caffeine hub? Uh, if the pattern moves on, there won't be any coffee here, no movie without the ticket, so we need to do something to make progress. I guess let's check out for now. Is there anything new here? This dude's eyes are still flipping the fuck out. She's still not here. Not gonna talk to this annoying motherfucker. Nothing, fine, shit, anything here that's new, nothing, god damn it, okay, let's go to the coffee, caffeine hub, check what's here, we've got, uh, what do we got? I wonder what's under the manhole cover. Like, more men, more people, more women, more whatevers, shit like that. Hey, there's a small pipe in here. I bet it will be useful in the near future. Well, if it's small, we know what else is small with you, dude. I know what you can use it for. Give yourself a little quickie. Hey, kid. You look a bit down. Is everything alright? <laughs> he looks a bit down because he's three foot and you're fucking seven foot, you giant motherfucker. No, I should be going to a costume party tonight. But I don't have a costume. The Halloween Central is all out of costumes! Oh, kid! It's your lucky day! I got you covered! Don't worry, kid. I'll try to improvise something. You will have a costume tonight. Hell yeah, he will. Look at this shit. Right for you, little motherfucker. Here you go, kid. That is the coolest <coughs> costume ever! Thanks, man! Here, you can have my fishing wire. Your fishing wire? So, should we go inside? Oh, can I use- Oh, wait. I know okay. what you're thinking. The crowbar is a magical item that can open anything and solve all your problems. Sorry, but that is not the situation. Oh, wait. It does work. Sweet! Oh, yeah. I got into the manhole cover. A lot of quarters in here. I'll take one with me. Oh, uh, what if I want all the quarters? I already have one. Come on, take it all. All right, let's go into the caffeine hub. Hello, have you made a reservation? This dude looks like tough shit, if you know what I mean. Reservation? I just want to buy coffee. You can't go inside without making a reservation. Oh, come on, dude, don't give a shit. But I just want to buy coffee to go. Besides, the place is empty. You're not going inside without making a reservation. Well, you're not going inside without making a reservation. Oh, no, blah, 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 now go away. I'm in the middle of a game here. Oh, you stupid motherfucker. So, we got the reservations number. We got a quarter. So, we go back to the pizza joint. We call this bald-ass motherfucker. We get the coffee. And... I have no idea how that will progress the story, aside from having coffee, we still need to get the pizza toppings and all this other shit, but I guess let's try. I 
want to make a reservation for tonight? Sorry, the place is full. Goodbye. <laughs> oh man, this dude is a son of a bitch. They go back to the caffeine hub. Is he on break, maybe? Come on, please let me in. I just want to buy coffee. No way. You have no reservations, so you can't come in. Now stop bothering me. I'm trying to beat my high score. Go screw yourself. I called. I tried to make a reservation. You said the place is full when it's fucking empty. And why the hell is this dude smiling so much when he's not getting any money? He's gonna have to pay taxes, bills, electricity. That is a bill, but still. Oh, shit. Oh, I'm so stumped. All right, guys. I will leave this episode here. If you like this video, smash that like button. If you're new here, press the subscribe button. And I will see you guys in the next episode. See ya.